Look at this short AI movie. In a city where trust is scarce and security is supreme, one crew will defy all odds. Led by the mastermind who knows no fear. Facing off against a relentless detective. And a vault that holds more than just money. Every move counts. Every decision could be their last. Get ready for the ultimate heist. This short movie is completely generated with AI. Yes, you heard that right. Everything from the dialogues, the visuals, and the music were created with AI. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the exact steps I used to create this short movie. First things first, we need a story for our movie. If you already have one in mind, that's great. But if you don't, no worries. We'll use ChatGPT for this. Just type in the prompt. Give me a short movie script on a bank heist. ChatGPT will come up with a thrilling story for us. Now, on to the visuals. Since we can't directly generate videos yet, We'll ask ChatGPT to create AI image prompts for each scene in a cinematic style. Be sure to specify that for quick cuts, it need to create multiple prompts. So we'll write, for each scene, create an image prompt that visually represents it. With our script and image prompts ready, it's time to create the visuals. We'll be using Flicky for this. We'll go to Flicky.ai, sign up for an account, and create a new file. After creating the new file, we'll get an interface like this. Click on the media icon in scene one, switch to the generate tab, paste the text from your image prompt into the instruction field and hit generate. Flicky will create an AI image for you. Next, switch to the AI video clip option and hit generate video clip using this image. Now we have a video clip, but it still lacks the clarity we want. This is where another tool comes in handy, Videoproc. Videoproc is a one-stop AI video enhancer and converter. We'll use this tool to upscale and smoothen the AI video by frame interpolation. Let's dive into how to do this. First, we'll download Download and open Videoproc Converter AI. Next, we'll click on Super Resolution. Let's drag the AI video we just generated into the program. If your video features real-life content like nature or vlogs, select the Real Smooth V2 model. For animations, choose the anime model. Next, we'll set the scale to 2x. To better compare the differences, you can click the button to move the before and after slider. This definitely looks better. Finally, let's export the output. Next, it's time to make the video smoother by increasing its FPS. Go back and select Frame Interpolation, then drag the upscaled video. On the right side, choose 3x, 4x, or 5x to set the output FPS. Adjust other settings like video codec as needed and click on Run. Now this upscaled high FPS video looks fantastic. This cool tool also have 29 plus quick edit tools, including rough cut, merge, special effects, color adjustments, co-process, speed, audio control, and the list goes on and on. So we can leverage these tools to further fine tune the clips for our short AI movie. You can repeat the same process for all other scenes. I know it takes time and effort, but the results will be worth it. Okay, let me tell you a secret hack. You can use video proc at the end on the final video to increase the video resolution and FPS. This would save you a lot of time. For the voiceover and sound effects, we'll use Flicky again. We'll enter the spoken text in the voiceover layer and to change the voice, we'll click on the voice name. A voice selection menu will appear where we have a lot of voices. I really liked the Wayne's voice, so I'll use that. We'll download the voiceover from here. For the sound effects, we can add an audio layer, click on Choose File, and Audio Selection menu would appear. We'll switch to the Generate tab. Here, we can enter anything, select the duration, and AI will generate a sound effect for us. For example, let's add Siren of Police Cars and set the duration to 10 seconds and hit Generate. It has generated the SFX. Let's listen. <laughs> It's so cool. We can create sound effects for our AI movie with this. Now, we have generated mostly everything. The final step is to put all of it together. We'll use CapCut for this. Import all your clips into CapCut and arrange them in order. Add voiceover, sound effects, and music to enhance the cinematic experience. Make sure everything is nice and set. It's crazy how we're able to create such a promising short AI movie without actually recording anything. I hope you were as amazed as I'm. Oh, you're not amazed yet? Then here's more. I'm giving away five one-year licenses for Videoproc AI Converter. To participate in this giveaway, you need to do three things. Subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, and comment on your favorite part of the video. I'll draw the winners once the video hits 1k likes. See you next time!